Prior to embarking upon this or any other exercise program, consult with your doctor. Any user of this exercise program assumes the risk of injury resulting from performing the exercises and using the equipment suggested. intimidated by this place. California representing the most famous style of training, the Gold's Gym Workout. It's been developed over many years using proven techniques used by the world's most famous athletes, celebrities, and movie stars. Congratulations, you've chosen a way to make your dream body faster than anything possible. Every exercise will be done in a very easy manner that can be done with limited equipment right in your home. As a matter of fact, you can use household items and the workout will take you less than 45 minutes. This is a beginner's tape. By that we mean people who have never exercised before. Or people that have exercised but never got the kind of results that they were happy with. Men, women, 16 to 65 can use this tape. By using the simplest of household items like this broomstick and these water or milk jugs. Or these pails or a couple of sturdy chairs or even an iron. Be creative. And we can vary the amount of weight by changing the amount of water in the jugs or the amount of sand in the pails. You can get better results using this home equipment and our Gold's Gym techniques than most people in a fully equipped gym with limited knowledge. But by far the most important thing is that you get started with us today. Okay, the first muscle group we're going to be working is chest. And the first exercise we're going to do is going to emphasize the upper part of the chest. Now for women, that's very important for us to give us that full look at the top of our bust line. And guys, it's going to develop the foundation for our new athletic body. So the first exercise, we're going to begin like this. Chris is going to bend down, sitting down on the edge of his chair, leaning back 
With his elbows back, he's going to push the bar up, breathing out, and then he's going to bring it back down to his upper chest. Push it up, and then bringing it down. Okay? Okay, everybody, move into position and begin. One, two. Stay with us now. Concentrate three, on using the upper part of your chest. Four, Good. Five, Stay with us. Six. Now, seven. If you get tired, eight, stop. If not, nine. Stay with us. Ten. Concentrate on your upper chest. Eleven. Good. Twelve. Carefully putting the bar down. Now squeeze your palms together really getting the blood into your chest. This will make the exercise much more effective. All right, now relax for 30 seconds. Did you enjoy your short rest? Back to work. <laughs> we're still working chest, but this time we're going to be working the bottom of our chest muscles. And Marsha's going to show us our dip exercise. We're going to have our feet back, supporting our weight on the chairs. We're just going to lower our body down, and with the elbows held out, press it up again. All right, you ready to go out there? Get ready, and let's begin. One. Squeezing the chest together at the top. Two. Inhaling. Three. Good. Crush it up. Four. Really developing those chest muscles. Five. Six. Nice and smooth, a lot of control. Seven. Now if you can't go this far, just stop and try and add one. Eight. About every other week. Nine, one more. One more time. Ten. Good. Okay, as soon as you're done, stand up, press your hands together a couple times, flex your chest. Now, take another short rest. Oh, hi. My name's Gregory Hines, and uh, from tapping throughout the years, you know, my legs get real stiff. Hi, I'm Gregory Hines, and uh, I may not look it, but I'm really 260 pounds. And I came to Gold to introduce me to the stretch program. Solid muscle. And it's really helped, because I used to be able to get my leg about this high. Very dense. Get it up here. It's not bad, you know. Turn over. Half dancing. Thanks. And now we're going to teach you something special. The Gold's Gym Super Set. A super set is when you do two different exercises without any rest in between. Our first one is going to be flies on whatever equipment we have. Marsha's going to lay back. And holding the books out wide, keeping our elbows on the same plane, opening up, stretching the chest, and then squeezing it together as she raises her arms. After that set, we're going to put them down, come on out into push-up position with our knees elevated, and with the elbows wide, just lower our bodies down, exhaling powerfully as we push ourselves up. All right. Everybody ready out there? Let's get into position. Ready, and let's begin. Open up wide. One. And squeeze the dumbbells together at the top. Two. Filling up with air. Three. This will really give you a great chest, guys and girls. Four. Open and squeeze. Five. Remember to keep your back arch nice and high. Six. Open up wide, keeping your elbows back. Seven. Look great in the t-shirts, guys. Eight. And two more reps. Come on with us. Nine. Last one. And ten. Now let's go directly into our push-up position. And with our hands out wide, 
and our chest up, begin. One. Really power yourself up. Two. Good. Three. Think about the chest. Four. Not using your arms. Five. Only using your chest muscles. Six. Seven. This is gonna make your chest firm and eight, strong. Nine. One more. Ten. Good. Now take a rest for 30 seconds. teaching you something even more advanced than the superset and that's called the triset that's when we do three exercises in a row to work the same muscle we'll be doing the front of our shoulders the side and the rears I've added some sand to my pails to make them heavier okay so why don't you watch us demonstrate and then you can follow okay we'll begin first by the sides then we're gonna move straight to the front raises and then we're going to bend over, arch our back, and move to the rears. Begin with sides. Ready, and one. Two. Okay, now this is going to give you a beautiful sweep on your three. shoulder. Nice and smooth. It's chest Four. high. Five. Filling up with air and squeezing Six. it out. One more time. Seven. Let's go to front raises. One. Out far away from your body. Two. Big delts in the front, guys. Three. Four. Not too much swing into the body. Five. Great. Two more. Six. You'll never have to buy those shoulder pads again. Seven. Let's Great. bend over to rears. One. Two. Great. Stay with us. Three. Four. Five. Let's keep Good. going. Six. Seven. Great set. My delts are pumped already. Mine too. Now everybody relax for 30 seconds. Just because you're 45 or 50, you know, you don't have to cave in and get atrophy. You just start easy. You know, don't try to fight off the whole world at once and kind of sneak up on it. It uh, makes you look good. Makes you feel good. It's good for your love life too, you know. <laughs> So hang in there, be feisty, and kick butt. Make sure it's not yours and gets kicked. I'll see you. Okay, we've got another set of shoulders to do, so let's get started. Ready, and begin with sides. Ready, and one. Two. Three. Nice and smooth, it's chest four. high. Five. Filling up with air and squeezing Six. it out. One more time. Seven. Let's go to front raises. One. Stay in one piece. Two. Concentrate only on your shoulders. Three. Don't use your Four. arms. Four. Just your shoulders. Five. Great. Two more. Six. You'll never have to buy those shoulder pads again. And seven. Let's Great. bend over to rears. One. Two. Great. Stay with us. Three, four, five. Let's keep Good. going. Can you be a great boss Six, here? seven. Great second set of shoulders. And now we have 30 seconds just to relax. 61. 62. Hey, I'm Lawrence Hooper Jacobs. I've been coming here to goals for about three years. When I first came here, I could even do one of these. 67. Now? 68. Matt, if you work out at home, or if you work out at goals. Okay, that's pretty good. Oh, at least you did fine. Pretty good. I like it. You're great. Oh. 
The next body part we're going to be working is back. By working your back, it also makes your waist appear smaller, too. And that's something everybody wants. We're going to start off with the Gold's Gym Superset. We're going to begin with bent over rows. Marsha's going to bend over with her back arch, take a wide grip on the bar, and pull it up nice and slowly into her rib cage. Exhaling, she's going to lower it. When we're done with that, we're going to move directly over to pullovers. We're going to extend the arm straight over the body and with a nice big stretch, go back, filling up with air and exhaling as we come up. So let's put that down, walk over to our equipment. Everybody ready now? Let's begin. And one, two. Stretch it out, get a good squeeze. Crunch together between Four. your shoulder blades. Five. Keep it going. Exhale. Six. Seven. Eight. Nice stretch at the bottom. Nine. And ten. Okay, let's move right over and do our pullovers. Lift it over your chest and begin. One. Two. Really stretch your chest out. Three. And your rib cage. Four. Five. Really expand the rib cage. Six. Good. Stay with us. Seven. Now, if you can't do this many, eight. Stop. Nine. One more. Ten. Great. Good tough set. Now let's rest 30 seconds before we go on. Continue working back. We're going to do an exercise that shapes and tones your back really fast. You're going to hold yourself up over the bench, and with a long motion, you're going to sweep from way in front of your head to all the way behind your hip. When we've done our repetitions there, we're going to switch over with no rest at all and go to the other side. All right, ready out there, everybody? Grab your weight and let's begin. One. Really stretch it. Two. Really use your back. Three. Don't use your arms. Four. Good. Five. Really let it stretch six, out. Six. And power it seven, up. Seven. Good. Eight. You with us? Nine. One more. Ten. Now let's switch arms. Ready and one. Good stretch. Two. Concentrate just on your upper back. Three. Don't use your arm. Four. Only your back. Five. Really put your mind into the muscle. Six. Good. Seven. Good. Stay with us. Eight. Two more. Nine. One more. Ten. Great. Now with no rest at all, we're going to go to our second set. Ready and begin. One. <sighs> two. Squeezing it in real tight. Three. Way back to your hip. Four. Five. You might even rotate your hip into a little. Six. Good stretch. Seven, eight, nine. One more. And ten. Let's move right over into the other position. Ready and one. Good stretch. Two. Really crunch it at the top. Three. Rotate your hip a little, get that great four, contraction. Five. Let's go. Six. <laughs> Almost done. Seven. Come on with us. Eight. Great back. Nine. And the last one. Ten. My back feels great. All pumped up and 30 seconds to rest.
The next body part we're going to be working is arms. And what guy doesn't want a set of big, powerful arms? And we're going to show you the absolute best way to get them. Now, ladies, we know that our bodies can't develop large muscles like guys, but we still need to work our arms, especially the area underneath here. So we're going to start out. Chris is going to demonstrate with the first exercise. He's going to lie down and take a narrow grip on the bar. He's going to raise the bar up over his head using his triceps and slowly lower it to his forehead raising it up and lowering it to his forehead. Then he's going to go into the bicep curl. He's going to pick up the bar at a shoulder width apart. He's going to raise it up, curling it with his biceps and extending it all the way down. He's going to curl it up and extend it all the way down. Okay, everybody ready out there? Let's take our positions and let's get ready to start the first exercise. Nice narrow grip on the bar. Take your positions. Let's Ready. begin. And one, two. Keep your elbows close together. Three. Really feel your triceps squeeze four, at the top. Five. This is the best size builder you can do. Six. Seven. Three more. Nice and controlled. Eight. Nine. Get a great contraction that last and rep. And ten. Let's get ready to move on to our curls. Grab your barbells. Shoulder width grip. Ready and begin. One. Squeeze it at the top. Two. Keeping your elbows into your side. Three. Don't let that body sway four, too much. Five. Nice and smooth. Six. Come on, guys. Seven. Inhale. Exhale. Two more. Nine. And last one. And ten. Now flex your arms back and forth, working the muscles against each other. And then let's just relax for 30 seconds. And now for the last half of our arm workout. We're going to do another Goals Gym superset. We're going to start with the arms extended straight over the head and then lowering them back, getting a long stretch of the tricep and a big squeeze all the way to the top. Right after that set, we're going to move into our seated curls. Holding the weights, we're just going to curl them up nice and smooth, the elbows into the side, and then put them back down. All right, everybody ready? Let's begin that first set. Okay, and begin. One. Squeezing it up. Two. Three. Exhaling on the way up. Four. Flexing the triceps. Five, six. Elbows together. Seven. Three more, let's go. Eight. Nine. Last one. And 10. Okay, let's move on to those bicep curls. Everybody ready out there? Let's and begin. Go. One. Two. Squeezing it up, elbows in tight to the Three. body. Not much motion. Four. Inhale. Five. Exhale. Six. Keep going, guys. Last set. Seven. Three more. Eight. Nine. Squeeze them at the top. Last one. And ten. Great. Now keep flexing your arms, working the biceps and triceps against each other. And that's it for arms. Now, just take a nice break for 30 seconds. Everybody's always looking for the fountain of youth. Well, we've had the fountain of youth. I hate to tell you, it's been with us for a long time. What it is, it's working out. Mother Nature pulls us down. The only thing that you can do to resist that is pull back up and weights no matter if it's weights uh, gymnastics or whatever it is any kind of athletic uh, endeavor is going to fight gravity 
and that is our uh, way of staying young and in shape and healthy. Every woman wants to have beautiful legs. And guys, we need to work our legs too to keep our physique in proportion. So we're going to do another Gold's Gym superset, and we're going to start with a first one like this. Chris is going to pick up the bar, rest it on our shoulders, going to take a wide stance, and then we're going to go down, and then we're going to push back up. We're going to begin the second exercise by grabbing two dumbbells. And we're going to do one leg of, at a time. We're going to lunge forward with one leg. We're going to come back. And then we're going to lunge forward with the other leg. All right. Ready, Chris? I'm ready. Let's begin. Wide stance squats. Let's go. One. Two. Really push up from the bottom, keeping your back straight. Three. And using only your legs. Four. Good. Stay with us. Five. Keeping your legs moving in one piece. Six. Really concentrate on your legs. Seven. Really push up from the ground. Eight. Good. Nine. One more. Ten. Now carefully press the bar over your head. Slowly lower it to the floor. Let's pick up our weights and move into our lunge position. Ready? Begin. One. Now this may feel a little out of balance at the beginning. Two. But you'll get used to it. Three. Put all the weight in your hip, not in your knee. Four. Now if you can't do as many as we're doing. Five. Then stop. You can always build up in your next six. set. Six. Good. Seven. Stay with us. Keep your back straight. Eight. Keep your head up and keep balanced. Nine. Your center of balance in the middle. Ten. Two more. Stay with us. Eleven. Good. One more. Twelve. Great set. Now take advantage this time to stretch out your legs. And we'll rest for 30 seconds. Okay, let's do our second set of legs, being very careful, squatting down, using our whole body to pick the weight up to our chest and over our heads. Let's begin. One. Okay, stay balanced now. Two. Keep your back straight and your head up. Three. Powering up from the ground. Four. Good. Stay with us. Five. Feel the blood pumping in your legs. Six. This is going to make beautiful legs. Seven. Stay with us. Eight. Two more. Nine. Come on. One more. Push up. Ten. Carefully press the bar over our heads, lowering it back to the floor. Let's pick up our weights and move into our lunge position. Ready? Begin. One. Try to stay balanced now. Two. Now if you're tired. Three. You don't have to do as many as we're doing. Four. Stop when you're tired. Five. Keep your center of balance in the middle. Six. Good. Seven. Head up. Eight. This is working your glutes and hamstrings. Nine. Giving you a nice sweep on your thigh. Ten. Two more. Stay with us. Eleven. Good. One more. Twelve. Great set. Carefully put your weights down. Do a little more stretching. And then let's relax for the next 30 seconds. Good set.
It's important that you follow the sequence of exercise exactly as we've shown them to you in this tape. That's the Gold's Gym way. And now we're going to work lower back. We're going to show you by starting with deadlifts, sinking down with our hips and using our whole body to lift the bar up, flexing it at the top. We're going to use a little wider than shoulder width grip, exhaling as we go up, filling up as we go down. OK, everybody ready out there? Let's begin. Ready and one. Using your whole body. Two. Squeeze it at the top. Keep your head high. Three. Flex your legs and your back. Four. Nice and smooth. Five. Inhale. Exhale. Six. Keep it going. Let's go. Seven. Three more to go. Eight. And two more. Come on, guys. Head high. Nine. One more time. Squeeze it up. And ten. Very good. Put it down. Take full advantage of the next 30 seconds. Catch your breath for our last set of back. Okay, let's get ready for that second set. Bend your knees, grab your bars, ready, and let's go. One. Okay, stay with us. Two. Now remember, if you can't do all the sets that we're doing, three, stop. Four. Good. One piece. This really works five, your calf and your glute area also. Six. Good. Stay with us. Seven. Stay tight. Stay balanced. Eight. Concentrate. Think about Nine. it. Nine. Concentrate. One more. Ten. Great set. All right. Now relax for 30 seconds. Working out is one of the most important things you can do for your body. But one of the things that you have to do to back up the workout is nutrition. If you don't eat well, your body's not going to be able to sustain the workout. It takes two to do anything in life. So it takes nutrition and working out to make the body strong. So listen to your body and feed it well and use the workout to take that energy and to turn it into something special, which is who you are. I've heard everyone say they've done hundreds and hundreds of stomach exercises with no results. Why is that, Chris? Because there's a method that they don't know about. It's working the lower abdominals before you work the upper ones. It's a Gold's Gym technique. And if you do exactly as we show you, you'll see results immediately. We're going to start off with 15 repetitions of each exercise, and we want you to work up to 30. Let's go. Starting with our hands under the hips, we'll extend the legs, keeping them elevated off the floor. And while exhaling, we'll raise them up to about a 45 degree angle. Let's begin. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven. Stick with it. It's really eight, gonna pay off. We're gonna get fantastic nine, results faster than you ever dreamed ten. possible. 11. So come on, let's squeeze 12, it together. 13, 14, 15. And then with no rest at all, hands behind your head, go right into crunches. One, two, three, four, five. Okay, we exhausted our lower abs. Seven. It's the perfect time eight, to get incredible results nine, on our uppers. Stay tight. 11, 12. 12 13, 13, 14, 14, 15. 15. And now we have 30 seconds just to relax. The last rep is as important as the first one. Get hard, you have to get real. You have to concentrate. Train hard. So listen to your body. Work out hard, make it worth it. You can do it too. All you have to do is believe in yourself and apply yourself, visualize where you want to be and make it happen. You take care, train hard. Have a good life and stay strong. Okay, ready for that second set? 
Let's begin. One, two, three, four, five, six. I know it's the end of the workout. You're tired. Seven. But for a little extra eight, effort now, squeeze nine, them out every rep. You're gonna ten, get in the stomach you never thought you'd be able to have. Eleven. So come on, let's squeeze 12, it together. Thirteen. Fourteen. Fifteen. Okay, now let's move into the crunch position. Ready, and one, two, three, four. Really getting a great five, contraction six, and squeezing it for a short, seven, flat muscle wall. Eight, that'll never nine, stick out over a 10, belt. 11, 12, 12 13, 13, 14, 14 15. Wow. What a great workout. We've just worked our entire body, but that's only half the story. That's right. Now we're going to go listen to some Gold's Gym professionals, and they're going to tell you how to maximize your diet to get the results you want as fast as possible. You know, consistency in your diet and following this tape is all you'll ever need. So we'll see you in a few minutes. Bye-bye. We're here to talk about proper nutrition and the importance of it and you reaching your fitness goal, whatever it may be. To get proper results from any kind of exercise, whether you be at home or on the field or in sports or whatever it may be, you have to eat right. You will never achieve your fitness goal without that. You cannot upgrade your physical condition without upgrading your nutrients. Most of us don't know exactly what to eat and how to eat. That's I mean, especially for beginners. For all you beginners out there, it's important to know the amount of protein you should be taking in, the types of carbohydrates you should be taking in, and the types of fats. We'll talk about protein first, since it's one of the most important nutrients to your body. Most of your muscle is made from protein. The rest of it is made from water. So you must get that protein back in to replenish these nutrients. So about 20% of your total caloric intake should be protein. Let's talk about the best sources of protein for you, including your diet. These would be very lean fish, very lean beef, of course, such as flank steak or round steak, poultry, skinless, and soy-based products, such as tofu. Avoid fatty meats, of course, and of course, high fat or whole dairy products. Now let's go to carbohydrates. The bulk of everybody's diet should be carbohydrates, mainly complex. When I say complex carbohydrates, we're talking about starches, okay, such as potatoes. We're talking also about grain products, rice, breads. These are all very good sources of carbohydrates and very little fat. Once again, this is the bulk of your diet because it is fuel for your body. It is the very first food product to leave your body and be released as energy. So this gives you energy throughout the day. Complex carbohydrates should be eaten about two hours before your workout, whatever it may be, or exercise program, whatever you're doing. If you're going to have a simple carbohydrate, stay away from all your refined sugars. Refined sugars are very detrimental to your system. Don't you dare. Fruits are your best source of simple carbohydrates, and that's your quick energy burst. Now let's talk about fats for a minute. The average North American diet consists of about 40% of their total caloric intake in fat. That is at least twice as much as it ever should be which means, of course, we are storing a lot of it. We're taking in too many calories with no nutrients. Every diet must contain a certain amount of fat. Most protein sources contain the fat you need, no matter how lean they are. Low-fat dairy, fish, chicken are all good ways to meet that special caloric intake you need of fat. However, your best sources of needed fat come from vegetable products, such as tofu. They contain the essential fatty acid that your body actually needs. When I say essential, it means your body cannot make that. It has to be supplied in the diet. Marsh will be showing us a delicious high protein shake made from the gold proline protein powder and mori new tofu which is very low in saturated fat and contains those essential oils that we just talked about you eat properly three or four times a day keeping the nutrients available to your body all the time to synthesize muscle and of course to starve the fat it is essential that you eat a variety of nutritious foods including vegetables fruits and eliminate those added fats and now that you're exercising more and breaking down your muscle tissue we recommend that you supplement your diet with a multivitamin pack this will help your body function at a much higher level. It's very easy to forget proper nutrition. You can't exercise properly without proper nutrition, and you won't get the results from your exercise without proper nutrition. So definitely incorporate the two, and good luck to you. You already know that a protein shake is the best way to get the most amount of nutrients with the least amount of calories. Provided, of course, you use the right ingredients. Now I can show you how to make a delicious protein drink and I'd like to start off by using a package of tofu. Most of us use Mori New Tofu. 
As far as our research goes, it's the best we've found for a complete protein from a vegetable source and it's cholesterol free. It contains all eight essential amino acids, so its protein efficiency rating is as high as any protein source available. Now I take my Mori New package, 10 ounces of frozen strawberries, one very ripe banana, and of course I like to boost the protein so I add three tablespoons of Gold's Gym Proline Vanilla Protein Powder. It's also from soy protein, lowers cholesterol, and tastes great. There are lots of other ways of making protein shakes. See the enclosed booklet for details. Mm, it's my little dessert. Gold's recommends that you work out Monday, Wednesday, and Friday. That leaves your weekends free. And with proper nutrition, you're going to improve and come back stronger after every workout. Now be consistent with your workouts. A little soreness is totally normal. Look at it as a sign of improvement. You'll see results immediately. We'll see you the day after tomorrow for the next workout. Now watch some of the scenes from our intermediate workout video, Level 2 of Gold's Gym Personal Trainer Series. We're going to introduce you to a new fantastic Gold's Gym technique called the Extended Set. Now squeeze your chest together, tense those muscles. Upgrade your physique, you have to upgrade your nutrients, or you're just going to reach a sticking point. Every woman wants to have long, beautiful, well-toned legs. And it's very important you pay strict attention to the details, because that's going to make all the difference in the world and the results you're going to get. All right, that's it for back. Rest for 30 seconds.